Hello, and welcome to the TWE channel. Today we're going to be talking about discussing five different ways to revise, especially as seeing as exam season is just around the corner. I know you're probably sick of hearing your teachers say this, but revision is very important as it helps you to effectively prepare for an exam. And there are actually two types of revision, active and passive revision. Passive revision is things like reading over your notes, which might feel helpful, and it is somewhat, but it's certainly not enough. So here are some ways to actively revise. Flashcards. Flashcards are the most common and easiest way to revise. It's a great way to learn terminology, and flashcards can also help improve memory and your retention of information. Mind maps. Mind maps can be another helpful way to revise. When using mind maps, you are able to plan out ideas and structure information for your essay or other writing. They are also helpful for collaboration and working with others to sort out ideas. Many forms of mind maps are available, including some virtual solutions, which can be especially helpful during the lockdown. Videos. Videos can also be another great help when revising. YouTube has many educational videos with lots of helpful information, ranging a wide variety of topics. Even when revising, you can usually find helpful information on YouTube as well. Be careful, however. When searching, there might be deceiving or unfactual information in videos. Practice papers. One of the best ways to prepare for revision is by practicing. Practice papers and worksheets can help with just that. Every situation is different, but using practice worksheets that prepare you for your revisions or tests can be helpful. Inquire with your school and teacher to check if there are any practice worksheets available to use. You can also search on Google for worksheets or information that might help you prepare for revisions. Use your time effectively. This isn't necessarily a revision tactic, but it's an important thing to consider when preparing for revisions and makeup tests. Using your time effectively ensures that you are preparing in a timely manner, which is typically crucial in a school environment. Using your time effectively also helps form a helpful habit that you will most likely use later on in your educational career. To recap, exams can be stressful, especially when having to deal with revisions. Making sure that you use proper revision tactics and test-taking practices can help mitigate some of the stress from school and the exam season. We hope you enjoyed this video. Goodbye!